So how would you rate your emotional intelligence? What is emotional intelligence? Can you raise your emotional intelligence? So much has been written recently about emotional intelligence and how there's a lack of it in hiring and how it sabotages people. So I wanted to share a couple of tips on how, yes, you can raise your emotional intelligence. So the first tip is to fully understand what emotional intelligence is. So in the same way that your intellectual quotient or your IQ measured your academic capability, well, so does your EQ, your emotional quotient, measure your emotional capability. But it's broken down into the following. It's broken down into self-awareness and drive and then empathy and acute social skills. So let's start off with how we, as people in the professional development world, can help people raise their level of self-awareness. So we do this through an understanding of your personality style and how you interact with others. And in my classes and workshops, trying to take people off autopilot so they can observe themselves. How do you develop more empathy or acute social skills? One of the ways that we do this is to understand your personality style and how you operate and what are your priorities. So one of the tools that I use in personality style is that of DISC. So if you think of D-I-S-C, it's are you a dominant director personality? Are you more of an I personality, an influencer? Are you more of an S personality, a steady? Or are you more of a C personality, conscientious, detailed? So hence the term DISC. Now there are many other personality profiles you can use, HBDI, Myers-Briggs, the list goes on. But the key is to help you and your teams really develop a profound understanding of your own style and priorities and how similar or different they may be to the people around them. And that's just step one in really developing the most important thing we can, and that is greater emotional intelligence. For more advice and guidance on how you can improve your or your team's EQ, please go onto my website, mariaspeaks.com, or subscribe to my YouTube channel.